<laughs> that was fun. <laughs> hey you guys! Welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title of this video, we are doing another L-Box unboxing. I think I do want to stick with this subscription service just because it's so convenient and it makes a lot of sense. Um, my box, I forgot to email and change it, so my box is essentially the same as last month. Why? Because I didn't have enough minutes in a month, apparently, to call or to email Sorry and be like, yo, can we change my box? So now that I'm thinking about it, I'm going to go do that as soon as I finish filming. But I'll start off with the tea because it's, it's differently packed this month. It looks super organized, which last month's students, but I think that was Canada Post's fault. Um, but the first thing that's in here is tea from Capaliano's Tea House and Botanical Soda. Uh, but it's missing a thingamabob. It's missing like the descriptive packet on the top, so... But it smells like chocolatey. I could be real wrong. But I also see like flower petals in there, but I don't know. Anyway, that's the tea. As always, I don't drink it, I will be re-gifting it. Um, I also have the Emergency cho Chocolate? Chocolate from Daniel Le Chocolat Belge. This is the cutest thing ever, and I love these. They're really good. It's really good, really creamy, really milky chocolate. 10 out of 10 recommend. I just love the packaging. In case of pressure, studying, decision making, hunger, cravings, stress, boredom, a broken heart, a tearjerker movie, road trips, mood swings, midnight munchies, or tests. Remove wrapper, break into mouth sized portions, and consume entire contents. If symptoms continue, promptly refill at any Daniel Le Chocolat Belge store. This is, like I said, a BC chocolate. Oh, like I've said in previous videos, this is a chocolate made on the west coast of the country in British Columbia. Um, it's grey milk chocolate, like I said, it's a nice little treat, so bonus. Um, I will say before I get into the period products of that, I am excited because as you guys know, I am a den head. I love Dragon's Den Canada. I have been watching it for as long as it's been on the air. It just had its 10th season. And I was scrolling through my tweets there a couple of weeks ago, and I'm always keeping up on the latest business news. I think it's fascinating. So, L-Box is going to be in next season's Dragon's Den. I'm so excited because this company is really cool, and I just think it's practical. So, and there's two female dragons now instead of one, and um, they're young. They're very young, so they might look at it as a very practical idea because subscription service is such a good idea. So, anyway, I think Michelle would be the perfect dragon to pair with L-Box. That's just a thought. I'm super excited that um, that they're going to be in the den, and um, I love when products I already use make it big enough to be able to ask for investment. And I also love watching Dragon's Den because sometimes I find things there that I never even knew I needed in my life, and then they show up on my TV on a Wednesday night, and I'm like, get me some of that. I love supporting Canadian business, so I'm glad that I can help out sometimes. Um, anyway, back to the box. Uh, this month I got overnight pads again. These are the Always Infinities, and I think there's 13 in here, which is essentially a box. Well, there's 14 in a box. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, 13 pads. And then I got the Tampax Pearl Supers uh, in the tampons, and I got 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 13 of these, so that's 26 period products, as always, so yay for that. And then I got uh, panty liners again. These are the Always panty liners, and they're individually wrapped. The Always Infinity ones are not, so I don't like those. They just come in a big box, you just pull them out of the box. I don't like that. I like the individually wrapped ones. And then, oh, we got the crappy wipes again. <laughs> these are the Equate ones that are crap. These are the Walmart brand, and I did like a side-by-side -side of these and the U by Kotex ones. These are like Zippo moisture. Oh, I intend, maybe I lost that footage. Hmm, let's do that again. Okay, these are crap anyway, they're going in the garbage, so let's just do a test run. It'll be fun. I am back. Um, so, I guess we'll start off with the Walmart brand wipes. Ugh, okay. I can't remember what I said about them. It's like, okay, as soon as you take them out of the packaging, they legit do not feel like a wet wipe. Like, they feel pretty much dry, which sort of sucks. And they are, like, super, super thin. Like, if I just pull a little bit, look, there's a... Look, it's tearing already! And it's, like, barely moist. Um, it's not very wide. It's just... It's more long than it is wide. Like, I just, I'm laying this on my skirt right now, and it doesn't even feel damp. If you open the Ubi Kotex one, um, it's like dripping wet, 
like proper wet. It has a fresh scent to it and it feels super thick when you're touching it like and it feels quilted versus the Walmart one. And look I'm pulling and you can feel the resistance and it's my hands are wet they feel cleaner. Um, and then if you compare them like lengthwise the Walmart one is longer but the UV Cotex one is wider so anyway the UV Cotex smell better they're thicker they're wet they obviously clean better um, the the Equate ones kind of smell like well besides the fact that they just oh they smell like Lysol and believe me we don't need like weird smelling things down there anyway so I just chuck the Equate ones because I don't use them um but yeah because they suck um, and then there's the little paper worms, as always. So I'm enjoying LBOX. It is $12 a month. It ships within Canada. There's a $5 shipping fee. But if you look at the top of the box, this came from Surrey, BC, and it was $22.50 to ship to Newfoundland. So paying that $5, not a big deal in my mind. Uh, considering you get so many period products and you're good for another month and the fact that you can customize it to come right before your period starts or you can check off the irregular box and they just ship it out the first of every month. This is right on time for my period. I don't like next week is my period so it works out well for me that it's delivered right before I start my period so I don't have to worry about making sure I have tampons or pads in the house because I know they're coming in the mail and that's one less thing I have to check off on my go get it done list and that's one more reason to stay in the house and wear my PJs. So thank you for making life convenient, LBOX. Uh, with all that being said, I will link them down below, the Indigena website down below, and by the time this video goes live, my second giveaway for the Coastal Sense Revealed 2 palette will have gone live. So that giveaway will be linked down below as well. The first giveaway winner, her name was Ashley, and she's actually from Newfoundland. And I'm super really excited because I actually physically get to meet her now instead of having to mail a package to her. We're gonna meet for coffee, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be really cool. So, with all that being said, you guys, give this video a thumbs up if you like period box unboxings, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more fun content. Until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Bye!